Sadly, Londoners are waking up to the news of another dreadful incident in the capital that has left a number of people seriously injured. The attack unfolded whilst a man was already receiving first aid from public at the scene, and sadly that man has died. This is being treated as a terrorist attack, and the Counter-Terrorism Command is investigating. This was an attack on London, and all Londoners, and we should all stand together against extremists, whatever their cause. One man, as I've said, was pronounced dead at the scene. Eight others are in hospital, and two more were treated at the scene. All the victims were from the Muslim community. I'd like to praise the police officers who immediately responded, who gave life-saving treatment at the scene, but also very much those members of the public who assisted before and after this incident. Also at the scene, detained by members of that community, was the man suspected of being the driver during this attack. He has been arrested on suspicion of attempted murder. I would like to thank those people who helped police in detaining the man and worked with officers to calmly and quickly get him into our custody. Their restraint in the circumstances is commendable. This has been an incredibly challenging time for London and the emergency services are stretched. Nevertheless, we will all do absolutely everything we can with our partners to protect Londoners and our city. Now is the time once again for London to stand together to face those who seek to divide us. If you don't represent women in politics,